In this tutorial, you will learn how to configure the field evaluations for the MRS-1000 LiDAR sensor. Device settings are configured via the SOPAS ET software. You can download this software by following the link in the description text of this tutorial. Once MRS-1000 has been added in SOPAS, the device is shown as a new project component on the left. Next, you can open the device window with a double click. Please log in as an authorized client. Now you will need to check under basic settings that the device is in the application mode field evaluation. If this is not the case, use the drop down menu to select field evaluation from the list. If you now switch to the tab application, you will see the visualized scan data of the LiDAR sensor. For monitoring specific areas of interest, you can use individually configured fields. They contain a number of evaluation properties which define, for example, the size of objects relevant for detection or the time frame in which an object has to be detected. To configure a field, click on the button Add Evaluation and a new evaluation category is added. By clicking on Add Field Points, you will have the possibility to define the borders of the field simply by clicking in the scan view. To exit the edit mode, double click on the last field point. The now active field will automatically be projected from the zero degree layer to all four layers. If the field is infringed by an object meeting the evaluation properties, two indications will happen. The field in SOPAS, as well as the right LED on the device, will turn yellow. To edit the field points later, click on the Edit Field Points. Now either adjust the coordinates for each point in the table, or click on the respective points in the scan view and drag them. You can also select which layers should be evaluated, for example in this case, Layer 4 is not needed and therefore deactivated, so only layers 1, 2, and 3 are evaluated. To exit the edit mode, deactivate it by selecting the arrow. The evaluation properties contain some default parameters which are adjustable according to your application. For this, click on Edit Evaluation Settings. Here you can change the name of the evaluation and its activation mode. By default, the evaluation is always active, but can also be activated via input or time. Other parameters to adjust are the response time and the object size. There is the option of having more than one field in one evaluation. In this case, all fields have the same evaluation properties. In order to have different evaluation properties, you need to add further evaluations. The MRS-1000 allows for the configuration of up to eight multifunctional IOs. You can edit these by clicking on the tab Interfaces. Here the definition of each port is defined. The default setting are ports 1 through 4 as inputs and 5 through 8 as outputs. To get a reaction on the evaluation test field we just created, we choose port 5 as an output with the sources device not ready and test field. Further parameters are invert and or combinations, restart modes, logics and output modes such as PNP, NPM or push pull. 
please save this configuration permanently when you are done adjusting the sensor to the application requirements. Check the functionality of your configuration. Go back to the tab Application. There you can test with an appropriate test object to enter the field. In this case, the output counter of the selected port, now port 5, will increase by 1. This tutorial described how to set up fields with the MRS 1000 3D LiDAR sensor from Zig.